In this video, we will talk about rotavirus. Rotavirus is the most common cause of gastroenteritis in pediatric patients worldwide. Gastroenteritis is the inflammation of the lining of intestines caused by virus, bacteria, or parasites. These type of infections are common in children ages 3 to 35 months, particularly those who spend time in childcare settings. Of course, older adults and adults caring for young children have an increased risk of infection. In tropical regions, infection occurs year-round. In temperate climates, rotavirus infection peaks during the cooler months. For United States, it's common during December to April. The average duration of symptoms observed in one study of hospitalized children was 8 days. However, in mild disease, it can last for just a few days and conversely, protracted illness can occur. The symptoms are usually starts within two days of exposure to the virus. Early symptoms are fever and vomiting, followed by three to seven days of watery, non-bloody diarrhea. The infection also can cause abdominal pain. It's highly contagious and it's spreading by the fecal oral route. Children can catch a rotavirus infection if they put their fingers in their mouths after touching something that has been contaminated by the stool of an infected person. Usually this happens when children forget to wash their hands often enough, especially before eating and after using the toilet. Prevention is so important to reduce the spread of rotavirus. Wash your hands truly and often, especially after you use the toilet. Change your child's diaper or help your child use the toilet. But even strict hand washing doesn't offer any guarantees. And commonly used alcohol-based hand sanitizers have little effect on rotavirus. The treatment is supportive in nature and involves oral rehydration. Although the infection is unpleasant, you can usually treat this infection at home with extra fluids to prevent dehydration. Occasionally, severe dehydration requires receiving IV fluids in the hospital. We have a vaccine, oral vaccine for rotavirus. Vaccination can reduce the incidence of rotavirus, but is not 100% protective. And we have some contraindications for this vaccine, and those are intussusception, severe combined immunodeficiency disorder, and other gastrointestinal pathologies such as an uncorrected mechal diverticulum. That was the end of the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Join our channel membership from the links down below. Thanks for watching. See you later.